standing just in the third floor of Vidhana Sauda, right facing the high court. And you see the room number 344. This happens to be the room of Minister for Energy and Canada and Culture, Sri P. S. Sunil Kumar. But under the rediscovery of Vidhan Sauda Phase 3, we are just exploring how exactly the office of minister looks like. Just let me go inside. And this is a very spacious office, and you can see the very spacious office here. Honorable Minister will sit there and write up, I mean, write about the Honorable Minister. And it is a routine that almost the great leaders are being written. Here he has written the President, the Prime Minister, and the Usuraj Bhomai, sir, Chief Minister, as well as Ambedkar Saab and Ghani. Apart from that, this is a meeting hall also. And if you just go next to it, he has a Sardar Babai Patel statue, somebody has kicked in, and a module of uh, Kempe Gora. That is a big, I mean, new uh, beginning has started, and that is a module has been presented. And if you see, if you come to the dead end, you see his beautiful photo, a photo which has been enlarged to very well, and he is the present Canada and Culture Minister, V. Sunil Kumar. And to the left side, you see Bharat Mata photo as well as Kannada Thai Bhuvaneshwari. I may, I may recollect that this department, in his department, officially a Kannada Devate photo has been released. And not only that, Nara Gite has already been officially released under his ministership. Not only that, apart from that, he has achieved, I mean, he has taken a lot of initiatives. In the sense, if you go again, just come across, you can see when he got sworn in. And he was sworn on 4th. August in the month of 2021 and he started his political career from 1994 I mean 2004 and again 2008 and again 2014 and 18 2014 he was a, a position of chief whip and again in 2018 he became uh, the ruling party chief whip and afterwards he became the minister and the next coming here if you turn your camera this side sir you see that Lord Basweshwara a photo, it should be adorned. It is a government a government order that each and every minister's office as well as a government office should be adorned with this. And next, I mean, Swami Vivekananda photo. The most inspiring man ever in the Indian history, a great Hindu monk, always inspire everybody. And this is a Kannada clock. You may see that the clock which has been done by a government also. And this is one of the beautiful photo being adorned here. I just really, it's a, it's a first of its kind, the water resources taken up by our, our government, the minister's chamber. And this happens to be an antique chamber where it is also uh, well, uh, adorned with all the, I mean, uh, decoration with the sofa, then with the telephone facilities. And again, there's photos I mean, where he believes and worships here. And this is a, in a very simple way. With all this, uh, with all this, uh, coming to his uh, introduction about the minister, and uh, his father is M.K. Vasudev, and uh, he, he, I mean, he was born in Karkala, and uh, he, he is a family man, basically he is an agriculturist as well as a, a businessman. He started his political career in 2004, and again, and again in I mean, uh, 2008, and again he started his political career. Now, presently, he, he is a minister for Canada and culture. And in his Canada and culture, he has taken a lot of initiatives. And first, a uniform pay scale was fit for the artists, and ID was given, he increased their pension, and uh, that was one thing streamlined. The other important thing is that he decentralized his office. People coming across the state, and uh, the, I mean, it was the four, uh, four corners of the state, Canada and culture minister office is there. That is one important significant step. And Koti Ghana, this happens to be one of the biggest events where in almost 17 historical places, all the patriotic songs were sung unitedly. That was a beautiful event that had been done even in Vidhana, Sauda also. And he took regarding Canada, recently a legislation was passed, you are aware about it, in the recently concluded 15th assembly session. A legislation was passed to make Canada as a mandatory. And apart from this, he had taken several initiatives. Particularly, Kannada Rajot, so first time for the first time as in transparency, an online method was issued for the selection of the awards. You know, the selection was done in an online and everybody was surprised. And then the, and the allocation of amount for Kannada Rajot Sava for Shristi was increased from 1 lakh to 5 lakh. And this time around 67, uh, I mean, awardees were given the award this year. And apart from this, he has taken several other initiatives regarding regarding 
Kannada. And uh, uh, finally, uh, to say uh, transparency in booking and billing, particularly in many of the Rangayanas and many of the halls. And earlier there was a lot of lobby, and this has been cut short. And again, he also, uh, uh, I mean, initiated this uh, Kannada Ratna Award, which was given to uh, Dr. Puneet Rajkumar recently. And uh, here, and Kannada, and uh, apart from this, I've already told you, ID card, Nara uh, Gite, that was according to the, the Shaili of Mysuru, who is called uh, Mysurina Ananta Swami Tune. According to that, our Nara Gite was uh, fixed. And overall, he has taken uh, very good initiatives. And this is done under the discovery of Vidhana Sauda, phase three, uh, I mean, uh, the introduction of minister's office, initiated by Srimati Vasanta, founders of KCR Foundation, and news presented by Gnan Shekhar. Namaste.